First, take out of items from the package. There are monitor, camera, power cable, cigarette adapter, T tabs, and video cable. Like my operation. Take out the monitor. This is a 4 pin connector wire. You can hook it on the original mirror with two straps. When the monitor is turned on, the image will be appear here. Take out the camera. There is a white wire. When you cut the white wire, the image will be switched to front view, like my operation. Take out the power cord. There are two pieces for pin connectors and one DC connector. This is two tabs. There are two ways to install the camera. One is to install the camera in front of the license plate, like my way. Align the camera bracket hole with the license plate screw hole. Fix the camera to the license plate with screws. Another way to fix the camera behind the license plate. Align the camera bracket hole with the license plate screw hole. Fix the camera to the license plate with screws. Pick up the power cord. There are three connectors, include two pieces for pin connectors and a DC connector. Connect a four pin cable to the monitor. Like my way. Connect another four pin cable to the camera. Connect the DC connector to the cigarette adapter. Plug the adapter into the cigarette lighter outlet. Press the red button. The monitor lights up. The image appears on the screen. Press the red button again to turn off the monitor. Disconnect all power. Like my operation. Now we demonstrate the second connection method. Connect a 4 pin cable to the monitor. Connect another 4 pin cable to the camera. If your trunk have a secret lighter, connecting to the secret lighter is the easiest way to power the camera. You also can power the sister from reverse light circuit. Red is positive, black is negative. Red connect to the positive pole of the reverse light or tail light. Black connect to the negative pole of the reverse light or tail light. Pick up the camera. Press the LED sensor with the finger. You can see the LED light. Look my operation. Pick up the monitor. There are three keys. Minus key, M key, and the plus key. Press the plus key to quickly turn off the guidelines. Press the plus key again to turn on the guidelines. Press the M key to enter the menu mode when H appears on the screen. Press plus or minus key to move the guideline to the left or right. Press the M key again, then V appears on the screen. Press plus or minus key to move the guideline up or down. Press the M key again, 
then W appears on the screen. Press plus or minus key to adjust the width of the guideline, like my operation. Press the M key again to switch brightness. Press plus or minus key to adjust the brightness, like my operation. Press the M key again to switch contrast. Press plus or minus key to adjust contrast. Press plus or minus key to adjust saturation. Press the M key again to switch saturation. Press M key again to switch tint. Press plus or minus key to adjust tint. Press M key again to switch language. Press plus or minus key to switch language you want. Press M key again to switch the guidelines. Press plus or minus key to turn on or off the guidelines. Like my operation. The guidelines on screen. The process of connecting the camera to the lamp line. T-taps. T-taps has two holes and one hole is closed. The long line is the line of the lamp or the circuit line on the car. Thrust the car light line into the first hole. camera power cord. Plug the power cord into the second hole. Iron sheets. Clamp the iron sheet to the tap's bottom.